to whatever you get at the inquiry. By the time we go to proper trial, eh, they will now deal with them. But some people are trying to say that this is a domestic violence, which I strongly don't believe that it's a domestic violence. Ah, I, okay. So domestic violence could actually be on, on two, two, yeah, two parties. It could be from the woman's side. At this point, I think it's the woman's side that is actually being domestic violence, not the man. How about that? Yeah, but what I'm saying, okay, some people are also trying to say that it was a mistake, like it was self-defense and all that. You know, different stories. Don't put words in my mouth. See, let me tell you something. The only that happened looks like a domestic violence. It also looked like a mistake. Yeah. Because there was no intention of actually finding mobile. That's the truth. There was no intention of finding But why all the lies? That's because, the question. Because what happened, happened. And no, the lies are too extreme to be ordinary lies. They because too extreme. you notice that Wumi has been lying that she does not know. I was not there. Every little thing, okay. even at the corona inquest, I let's, wasn't there. I let's, assume, let's assume. Let's assume it was a, the picture. Let's assume it was a mistake, right? Simple. You call the police or you take his body to the morgue he hospital. He doesn't want to go blame in everything. So That's why does he go on. all the extra mile to doctor videos to formulate stories to lie? So that's why I say it's not anything connected to this was planned to kill Mubak. I don't I don't know if it was planned. I am not going to what I do not know. I am not going to be part of it. I do not know. Why I'm saying it was planned because when it happened too, Karimo came out and was lying again. One thing I know was that after the incident happened, she called her family and that's the main reason why they did not call Baba Mubak for them to quickly plan up every other thing that the next move. That's just what I know. And they try like, okay. How can they cover up so many things? What they're trying to do just to cover up. The woman um, doesn't want no link to her at all. And everything she tried to make sure that she covered everything that's gonna link, that's gonna link whatever happened to her. And that's just the way it is. So, so is, is there any possibility? I'm just asking. Like I don't want anybody to think. Is there any possibility that we might be losing some of Mobile's internal organs? Never. <laughs> wow. See, are you believing that as well? No, it's like, because autopsy is going on, right? Everything needs to be checked. Because at this point, we've heard so many things. They've gone, they've gone to see the body. Did they tell you that there's any internal, internal organ missing? They did. You know, they haven't thought about that. I don't there think... There was no internal... I was, I'm telling you today, there was no internal organ missing. But did they tell us there was a stab on Mubaz's body? Apart I'm not from gonna, I'm not, I'm, I am not... No, ma, they can't tell you there is a stab on Mubaz's body. All of that, this information why, can't be said to the public. That's why the autopsy is taking... All this information can't be said to the public. That's why all the, the autopsy is taking so long because they cannot come out and tell us what they saw in Mubaz, but because they have to. Hey, then wait till the result no, is out. Wait. I will not wait. They can't keep us for seven months. We should be waiting for no reason. No, autopsy doesn't take seven months. Why are you so pushing? They should it's come out pushing. and tell us what they've seen. No, Soma, you can't expect them to come out and tell us what they've seen. Why? Because they are police or what? Who are they? They can't did tell us. Did you, did you, did you want me to come out to tell you what killed Mubaz? It's not everything that I have to come and tell you that. Oh, okay, they should bring the people out to did. tell you what bring happened. Them justice. That's all. They don't need to come out to tell you everything that happened. Police Boss will man, not do you? this crime. They won't. Because I've seen their body language very laser fast. Because you don't know the game that they're also playing. By the time they go to, see, by the time they go to a proper tri um, trial, every of these things going to come out. Okay, let's wait for two more weeks. They told us to. There are some information that they, uh, I am not supporting the legacy, you know, but I'm trying to let you know for the fact. There are some information that they're taking away from the social media and from the public now, all right? But the thing is that you're telling me that they take any vital organs of mobile. I tell you, no, everything is intact. It's vulgar. Oh, baby, do they sold his kidney. They did not sold um, the kidney, uh, mobile's kidney. That's a big lie. Okay, do, are you also aware that nine people have died around David Doe in the past seven years? I know, and but nobody investigated no, I, it and the case went home. But what has that got to do with Mubad? No, Mubad. It's all connected. Stop, stop, industry all those, connection. stop all those wrong narratives. <laughs> I am not. It's all on the news, okay? It's all on the news. It's on the no. newspaper. Go and check um, it out. Queen B, nobody removed any vital organs of Mubad. Nobody removed it. No, the nurse did not sell any kidney or whatever to move their video. That is a reference. See, these are the things that is actually messing up the justice for mobile. People just come up in the morning and come up with a story. Who how would they who would remove the kidney of mobile? How? How is it possible? Please, 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 please. Uh -uh. They've gone to see the body twice and they, they did not know if the uh, intestine has been removed or the kidney has been removed or whatever. Come on, man. Did they look inside? Did they look inside? That's all. Hey, it's a question. Oh.
Boss man, are you a pathologist? Don't answer these questions I again. I am not answering. I am not answering the question because I was like, what kind of question is this? What I'm telling you, you are not a pathologist. Yeah. Yes. So what I'm telling if you. If someone wants to see the body, she can get a pathologist they, and get order to go and see the body. Anything to Davido. Is that why they're dragging Davido? That's his reason yes, why we're going no. to whatever. So I'm telling you for a fact. I know where that rumor is coming from. It's coming from YouTube. Those on YouTube are the ones spreading that rumor. Everybody wants fans. They want people to be. They want to. They want to gather um uh, viewers on their platform. Can I ask you another question? Yeah, that's Darusha, it. Darusha said yeah. that he was instructed to use the one million for burial. So who instructed him? I would, I would like to know who instructed Darusha that that money should be used for burial. Hello, Soma. How are you? Good it's morning. It's definitely not Baba. So who Soma. is it? Soma, when in some cases you are doubting what these people are saying, and in some cases you want to believe what they are saying, like Bosman said, anyone can come up and lie to you about anything. Where's the evidence that that was that transpired between them? Again, let us be patient. The legal team are doing a magic behind closed doors that everyone will be amazed. Just wait. We are going to get justice. I know we are very anxious. We are willing to get it now, now, now. But all these things take steps. Do you understand? There are so many things that will even if they are not talking, there are so many things that will come out and nail them. It's, it's going on. It's going to happen. We can't come on social media and start listening to what people are saying. I was surprised yesterday when I heard someone saying that um, Mubad's house was bought in Mubad's dad's name. I'm like, what? <laughs> I, I heard that where, too. I was just you know, laughing. You know where they heard that from? It's from the opposite team. You need to know these people are fighting you psychologically. They are doing every other means to give you wrong narrative. They know people are listening to them. They know when they're doing their life, there are people there. So they try to spare people. They try to say a lot of things about this case that will make you, that will mess up your mental health. You need to ignore all of these things, you know. Again, I heard you. I've been listening to you for a while. Um, you were saying they should drag Kubana to the priest. They should do this. They should, they should do that. At the end of the day, the Corona inquest on that oath. Ask Wumi, did you see or witness the fight between Prime Boy and Mobad? She said no. They ask you, did you notice any wound, any blood on your way from Ikorodu to the island? She said no. I only find out in the morning or when we get home when Mobad was holding his hand. That is the key. She didn't see it. There was no blood in the car. How can someone be bleeding? Previously in the car all the way from Ikorodu to Ireland. You know how many hours that is? My exactly. sister, please calm down, man. Some you relax. Some man, you've been doing you've been doing fantastic work according to your um investigative journalism and all that. But sometimes there are some people that do not do what you did, that they have to understand what actually went down in that house. Okay? And sometimes you need to listen and um and to other people's story as well. You're doing fantastic work um, work so far. And that's just, I understand what you're talking about. Like I tell, what Soma was trying to talk about was that she was trying to base an analysis, analysis on the statement of the police saying that, that during the police statement, the, um, the, the ideology, I mean, the narrative saying that Mubad bled profusely. That um, uh, Mubad bled profusely because of him. Um, he was trying to have a fight with um, um, his friend, um, Prime Boy, and then the glass cut his hand and it was bleeding profusely. And that, by, and she said, by that alone, they're supposed to invite Obi Kobana. I said, yes, I agree. You know, before we start digging into all these things that happened after the old incident. So with the statement alone, they're supposed to invite Obi Kobana and then ask him about... No, Obi Kobana chief priest, not Obi Kobana. Okay. I mean, Kobana chief priest, sorry about that, please. Pardon me. So that is what she was talking about, um, Lagata. But we've left that... But Lagata part, has dropped, though. Yeah. Hey, so, man. Bossman, let me quickly say this. You know, I actually had this argument with Soma this, uh, some days ago. And I was trying to talk about this Soso Berekon, the video Soso Berekon made after the incident. I think the video was before the police invited them. And in the, in the statement, Soso Berekon said there was no fight. That they had 25 security. He mentioned all the security measures that were, that were put in place. And after everything, Sosa Berekon said that he is surprised by all these stories he's hearing because they all left the show together, L and LD. That Mubad left the show. L and LD. Thank you so, for that statement that you're making, that they all left together. Right? 
Yes. Uh -huh. So what are you saying again? But they you were saying that together. it is their car. But you mm. saw the Prado at the front of Mobad House. The Prado he rented. So if these people are involved, do you think they wouldn't that Sosa Barakon was on the list now? As the police not gotten his reports, and that is what I'm saying the other time that you should compare the CTC report with the report with the video he made. And if there is any difference in it, we can now drag him again. Even by now, Prime Boy should even use that video. So, so uh, let's not be let's not be too emotional. Not let's emotions. not be concluding on assumption. If I was about emotions, I would be supporting women as per women supporting women. So I don't do emotions when it comes. No, to the emotion emotions. of mobile death, the pain no. of mobile death, too, is emotional. Thank you for saying this thing now to everybody that they all left together. That's the point. I want everybody to understand. They all left together. So that's where the investigation is supposed to start from. Together. Not from any other place. It's so my one we left together, please. The same no. convoy he came with is the same convoy they all left together with. Twelve car convoy. Twelve cars. Prado, whatever. Twelve cars. They came together. But we have discussed this convoy together. thing now. Okay, so if we have discussed it, why haven't we pressured the police? To do what? To include everyone's name on that convoy that left with Was it Soso Brecon or Kubana Chief Priest that rented Prado for Mobad? I don't know who rented, but I'm telling you that some more bad. Bosma, let me let me let me brief you. Someone was saying that Mobad went to the show together with them in an escort. Like they all left in together. Convoy. Convoy yeah. in a convoy. Which police but didn't tell us? And what was police on to tell us no, that police they went? told us they went in a two-car convoy. Meanwhile, it was and that was this. That's so the you car need to know where now. all the lies are coming from. There is oh, a, no. There's a lot of lies everywhere in the police reports. We 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 say summer. Yeah. We have passed all those things we are talking about. See everything from A to Z that the police said all lies. You listen to you obey whatever. I've, I've said that even the time of um, Berekete. Oh, you 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 um, believe what the police said. You are at your own risk. All lies. All right. Oh, now without bleeding profusely, it has truncated. See, two things that has truncated. Um, whatever the police said was that it bled profusely, and the fact that the police omitted the fact that Baba Mubad did not that Baba Mubad carried dead body to the police station. Yeah. The police omitted that part. That has actually messed up all the statements. And I've been challenging them every time I try to see. If I want to talk about justice, I am only showing shot at the police. They messed up this case. They did not do a good job. So, Bosman, are you so going to tell me? to say in their statement was that, at first, Baba Mubad carried a dead body in an ambulance to the station. They know that's going to, that's going to uh, uh, um, uh, um, mess them up. They omitted that part. They never mentioned that in their statement. Not only when we started finding that Baba Mubad carried dead body to this police station. Okay, boss man, can I tell you something? Can you build a house on lies? We're going nowhere with the lies. That's what I'm saying that we work. have to force the police to come out. We have to day. go back. Exactly. So, so that's what? Is, everything is all lies. All whatever they said to you, the police statement is a shame on them. That's how when I come for them, I know what I'm saying. They mess up this case, it's all lies. Let them come out. Police, are, they have their own um, doctors and medical field or whatever. Let them bring it. They should come and tell us. They should dramatize it. How is it possible? How many liters? Do we have 50 liters of blood in any human being's blood, a body? So how is it possible for Mobad Mo to bleed profusely from Kourou to Leki? Is it possible? Within the three hours, no human being can survive it. You will pie. That's just the way it is. We die on the way. So now, Titus, you are saying that there are some people that have a video of Mobad fighting with Prime Boy. And at this point, seven months later, nobody came out with the video of Mobad fighting. And you are believing in that narrative that Mobad fought with uh, whatever, and even with me that was present there, said that he should not witness no fight. A dread that was there said she did not, did not, uh, did not witness no fight. So, so those people that have videos, they're not keeping the video. So it's only one person that shot them. Please There's understand no what I'm trying to say. The video does not show a fight. The thought they could use, the thought they could instigate a fight between Mobad and Prime Boy, they were trying to record something. Okay. So... If so, they bring out that video, it's going to basically disprove all what their narrative is about exactly. Prime Boy and the so fight on the show. So they're not going to release that video. Narrative. 
Titus, sorry, Pardon? respectfully. You also believe that narrative that they. Uh, to be honest, I don't. I told you yes, uh, but you I wasn't there. Case, I wasn't they, there. They beat um, Prime Boy to Kobonachi. I didn't say they beat him. They chased him. He they was trying that, to. What I heard was that they beat him up. To the okay. beating him and chasing okay. him away to Kobonachi. I, I, to be honest, I don't think so. I don't no, think any no, beating no. like that happened. The fact is that. See, the fact is this: no video. And people took every recording under control, or the people that were recording were basically part of the script, and they don't want us to see that recording because it does not work oh, with their you script. Are, you are saying that people. You see the way you also sounded too. That um, you, you know, there's no video. You are not sure what you're saying. You don't you see. You don't authoritatively talk about things. I'm that telling you, there sure. is a video. I'm telling you, the video is not coming out because it does not support their narrative. The person that took the video is part of the people that's creating the script it How makes sense it was a video ask prime boy ask prime boy okay well i'm just saying that that there was a video i mean hearing there was a video but i had not so far i've not seen the video doesn't rule anything and two whatever happened in that house as well in mobile's house i wasn't there um and i was i was, ne I was never there but according to some people that knows whatever happened you know we know and we don't have no evidence but the narrative is that whatever happened in that case 70 percent or 80 percent of what happened to the storyline surrounding whatever happened in the house we have an idea of what happened in the house but was there any evidence for that no, no. so that is what we need to get to never lose people the dvr was there any dvr in the camera oh yes yes there was dvr even when the police are saying that there was no dvr no tell them what there are some experts that will tell you the date and time they remove the DVR. Come on, man, stop that. There are some experts will tell you. You can get the you can get the CCTV camera. Give it to me. I will go to those people that view the the, the, the manufacturer of this. They will give us we, 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 the date and time. They took the DVR out of that place. Are we playing? Come on, man. Oh, you the person now. Those that made that um, CCTV camera, they will tell us the day and time that the DVR got messed up. Take away. They will. That's what they call forensic. You do forensic for the CCTV too. Come on, man. And I'm telling you the facts. The person that removed the DV house did it intentionally, and just one of those people living in that house did that did the job. But the name of the person, maybe whenever whatever we get, they will do their findings of who did that. If the police did their job. But authoritatively, we don't have to talk about that. Yeah, well, am I going to be part of those that will say, oh, with me, you stand up, I will not say that because I was not there. It's only the judge, it's only the court that will say that. Well, I am not going to say with me by movement. But well, will I say that? Move. Was there any fight in the house? Definitely, yes, there was a fight in the house. Did with me by mobile, according to me, boss man, I would say no. But whatever I've led to mobile pie, the me out, yes, of course, Mumi knows about it. Definitely, yes. And Mumi also cost. Uh, I know, let, 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 don't let me use that word. Mumi cost whatever happened to him because there was something happened to mobile that made them to call the nurse yes not something happened to mobile that made them to call the nurse so the mobile died instantly no i don't think it died instantly it didn't die instantly yeah so uh, whatever happened man, after that, i do not know boss man did you uh, there was a video this guy uploaded this morning where perkins was narrating what happened at the show i think that one class uploaded this on his inter instagram Please go and download so, the video. Come and play it for us here. And let us come and I can't, see. I don't have camera. But it's on Dawa class Instagram. Anybody go, that go can. Download it. Go and download it first. Yeah, save it before they delete it. Once you don't oh, have it, okay. you say it. Go and download it before they delete it. Whoever, whether you see that's going to be useful for this. See, what is delaying this thing is evidence. Nobody get evidence. It's evidence that is what we need. Get evidence. Get evidence. And everything is close. It's close. I don't talk. I, of course, I'm talking very good. You're expecting me to talk out now. My words are going to be used against me. I'm not a judge. I wasn't there. I'm not talking parables. Question is where are we going with 
a lies full of in the police report that like which way where that are we heading to that is your job to do that is my job to do that is our job to do <laughs> we are the one person pay and paying the salary of the police it is our duty to blast the police it is our duty to petition the police it is our duty to tell them they should come and prove that that's the wrong narrative that they gave to us it is, let me tell you something summer yeah as of today the police are ashamed of themselves I believe that. You think they don't know what happened on Papariano? They know who Papariano is, man. <laughs> they know Papariano. I'm telling you for a fact. I'm sure they know. And they know what is going on on, on, on today. They know some people. They know with their names. They have videos. Videos of people. They are ashamed of themselves. They are ashamed of the government. Even the government, the governor of Lagos State is also ashamed because that stuff they made. They, have, you, have you seen that come out again? No. They're looking for how they're going to. And, and I'm saying that it is me. It is a legal team of Baba. We, it is the high time we do. We are. We are. It's the high time we do a press conference. A press press conference. We nailed the police of Nigeria State for giving us. You came to the national television to give to bamboozle the old generation of us, telling us somebody bled profusely, and we're telling. We're tasking you, um, psychologically, scientifically, come and prove how is how is it possible for someone to bleed profusely from Ikorodu to Lekki? Was there any forensic? Did they do any forensic? The police. Did you? Was there any blood? I will ask them questions, and they will fail with their kata. Because when you want to deal with people like this, with the government, number one, you cannot win the government. And number two, if you want to fight with the government, you have to apply your senses. It's not by shouting on TikTok and TikTok, TikTok, that you're shouting. No, no, no. You have to play. You have to be two steps ahead of them. Because they are mighty. The only person that I know that can deal with the government are, are the Falano and Co. All right? But if we want to deal with them, if we want to fight, face them, you have to apply your senses with them too. You have to. It's a game of chase. You can't be playing into their hands. The thing is this indict these people and the indictment is that number one the not, imagine the almighty the mega city lagos state the whole government um, uh, uh, the police i mean lagos state police coming to brief the public um, the, uh, um, about the, the homicide case and they are giving us a bamboozing story of someone bleeding profusely and you the justice of mobile we've been quiet for seven months instead of us to do um press conference and allow the international bodies to hear what the police people have done. They came to Babuz, yeah, America, all over the world. Is it possible for someone to bleed profusely for three hours, Johnny? They mess up there. When they never knew that the story of Baba Mubad carrying dead body to the station with surface on the social media, all the people will talk about it. You think they're not ashamed of themselves? They are in soup. The police, they are in big soup. Call them out. We have not gotten any lawyer or legal team that's going to face them. That will call them out. Let, it is high time we do press conference. With the press conference, we invite all the media houses, the international bodies. You think the international countries are the bodies that are not that they don't know who mobile is? They are interested in mobile. But because we've not done the right thing, but we're doing the press conference. Do you know that Wumi is also planning to do a press conference very soon? That's going to be the second time they're going to do a press conference. We have not done anything. Do you know that the press conference is to show everything that had happened from day one to where we are today? And you wish, that is where you are going to state all the shortcomings of the police, how the police messed up. Homicide case, you do not seal the house. You think they don't know what they're doing? They are in fish soup. Once you get a capable lawyer that will sue them. See, if fine boy... Get out of this. Primer will be swimming in money and in millions. Money. Once we get, well, he can sue the police. He has, he has done the right thing by suing them right now. Yes. Because Wumi does not have any reason for them to, uh, to write petition against um, Prime Boy. You do not invite somebody. You just, he came to do his normal routine. And then you carry him. And then you, 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 you put anchor for him. Come on, you don't do that anywhere. So, Indictment. The police has they've messed up in every areas, all angles. It's not left for us to do the right thing. Press conference is long time, I mean long overdue. We need to do the press conference, either a day after the corona inquest or before the corona inquest. But I think after the inquest, we'll be okay so that we can talk about what happened at the inquest as well. That's just the way it is. Once we do the press conference, invite the media houses, it will show everything to the world. Everybody all over the world wants to know what happened. happened. They know who Mobad is. They know who Mobad is. And they want to be part of it. That's just the way it is.
Police, they are in soup. They know they are in soup. You think your governor is not running a task getter? You thought all this case, thank God for the host and the TikTokers. They thought this case is going to die down in two months. For seven months, we're still talking about it. Every little time that we're talking about, bash the police. Talk about the, they don't want any one of us to talk about the uh, purposely. You think they don't want to... Normally, they will have come for another um, press conference. They've not briefed over any press conference. They said they want this case to be... Uh, what do you call it? Is it inconsequential? Is it no? They want this case to be to end with um it really uh, huh? irrelevant. No, not irrelevant. There's a word that they use, like you know, a, a case that doesn't oh. that was um very You should know this word now. Inconclusive, yes, inconclusive. Inconclusive. That is what they're trying to. But we are telling them that all what you did, yes, and that's why we are telling them that police from the day one, you, who are the people? I asked them, even in the bracket, I asked them, who are the people that did the investigation? Did you guys ask questions? Who? Give us the name of those of that. Do you know that one of those that, one of the officers that did the investigation was also um, pros um, promoted over this year, yeah, investigation that they did? They, they promoted one of the officers, who, and we are here screaming on TikTok. We do not ask them who, 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 who was, the, what was the name of that officer that got promoted over this case of Mubad. Which investigation did they do? Only that are not aware that there was a fight on the bridge or there was a fight at home. They were believing that it was the window of the SUV that made Mubad to buy, that made him to bleed profusely. Okay, police, if we say Mubad bled profusely, give us the car, please. Man, that was what that was what the police was told, right? And the way See, they failed us was to do a proper investigation. Exactly, you break the Gaza. They messed up big time. Now it not take it not take the whole TikTokers to become they turn themselves into FBI, CIA, and what the police could not bring out to the media. We so yeah, we are. They want to win that. They turn people to bloggers. To the story that up there is up. Well, the media is supposed to be bringing the briefing that they're supposed to be bringing to the public. We are the one that not giving it to them. Can you see? What are we talking about? You think they're not hungry? They are mad. You, know, you think they don't know what the sum of the host is? You'll be surprised. They know all these things. And boy, that went viral. You think they don't have the video? <laughs> so at this point, are they ready to do the right thing? They are not ready to do the right thing. Okay, they so... are not ready to do the right thing because why? Mm. You, the TikTokers, you rubbish them already. You have rubbish them. Do you know what? We can sue them as well. Do you know what press conference is? You came, okay, that's how we keep asking. Give us the name of those officers that, that did investigation. This, see, let me tell you the fact. With all this analysis, this police did not do any investigation. Thank you. They did not do no investigation. Even one. They invited with me, she wrote a statement. This one, right? This one. They use everything, compile everything, put it together. And now you need to come and give us a press statement, though. Thank uh, you. This, that is exactly what they did. So they're now saying that, oh, you did a good job, good job. Without even seeing the result of what they did, they already promoted an officer yeah, because they did a bad job. <laughs> they did a bad job. And we think we're going to let that slide. And you think they're going to come out to the media? Because the Ashiri is already busted. They don't know how to how to amend all these things. It's a shame on them. They know what it means that the ordinary, the Lagos state is the number one state in 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 Nigeria, in the West Africa, that all the whole world reckon with. And homicide case like this, the police of Lagos State messed up. Ah. Uh -uh. You now take the citizen to bring out the, to truth. You think some international bodies are not monitoring, monitoring all these things. Just let us do press conference. Press conference is the most. By the time we do it, we have the people of um, Black Lives Matters. 
You think they don't know that some of them don't know, some of the committees do not know what is going on with Mobad? Without the, uh, without the press conference, they will not come in. The international, what they call it, international nations, no. Um, all these um, people that fight for women's rights and all stuff like that, they are also interested in the case. But we have to do press briefing. That we go everywhere. Just like what we mean, they're also planning to, UN, yes, they're also trying to do, we mean, also planning to do our own press conference. Our own press conference is to jack power. We mean, press conference that they're planning to do anytime from now is for her to jack power. We have not done any. You think the police will allow that to happen? They are in soup now. Ah, man bled profusely. And they cannot defend it. Call them out, send an area police, come and defend it, they will run away. <laughs> they will run away now. Maybe it will mean that gave them that English and they didn't check dictionary. That's the mistake. mistake they made. Then one single mistake they made. Let me tell you something. Let me give you one Ashirina. The mistake they ever made was allowing the civilian to go to the party to talk to these people. Okay? That's the number one mistake. When they realize the mistake, the state government governor allegedly, and I want to use allegedly to try to cover myself, but it's a fact. Allegedly, Order the police that nobody must come to Panty to see these people. That was towards the ending part to see these people. Every saga that happened on TikTok, they have everything. The video of, you know, they have videos. You can ask Prime Boy himself. There's some video that they also show it to him. Eh, it's not you here. It's not you here. They know everything. They know. But it's going to be a shame on them. I know, I know where they're coming from. They will never come to the media to come and face us because they messed up. Even what it means for civilians to be bringing out duties, the things that the police are supposed to do. And then it's a shame on the governor of the state. It's a shame of the, of the, on the police as well. So we should call out the governor more. Let's start calling out the governor. Call out the police. These are the people that stole this case. If you want the press conference, if somebody was asking alone. the governor question no, and press, he shot up, Okay, that's not enough. We need to drag okay. Samwalu. We need to drag police. Every day. I am, I, am, I am not talking about dragging this time around. See, everything is all about dragging. Things are done civil. civil. See, in um, is it in Egypt? It took about two, three of um youths. Is it four or five of them for them to change the whole the whole saga that happened in the, is it Egypt or somewhere on the internet? The way on the internet, they they the, the, the revolution that happened there. You know. The thing is this, we don't have to do dragging. Dragging is not what is going to give us a solution. Let us wait for the press conference first. The press conference is going to be documented. You're going to invite media houses and even the bloggers. If you want to ask questions, it's going to be like three hours straight. You must ask every question thrown at you. It's not all the questions, though, but vital questions will be thrown at you, which is going to be streamed, it's going to be recorded, and the international bodies and the UN and everything, you invite all these organizations. Then it's going to be wow. It's not going to. It's going to go live. If you wanted to go live, we pay money. It's going to go live. You will expose the police. That is what the Lagos State Government did not want. You see what I'm talking about now? Press yeah. briefing. Or hey, man, let's do that side. now. We will. Maybe after the Corona, we're going to talk. We will see this. Then please don't say they make mistake do. again, no. They didn't make any mistake. All this mistake is to the advantage of justice. The because if, if, if they had been smart enough to cover up their track, we won't be getting all of this information we are getting. So it's not a mistake. Exactly. You guys, do you it's remember a good what thing. happened? Uh -huh. you guys, Don't you use the word remember. mistake. <laughs> be fair what they did for us. <laughs> you guys remember what happened at Berekete? When uh, the ordinary president asked the PRO or whatever of the police that they're supposed to, why didn't they seal the house? The PRO said that there was an uh, uh, investigation when they are doing um, forensic. Uh, it will take, even if it take more than six months, forensic is still going to do everything and all that. They're still going to get everything. I was like, you see that? The ordinary president was just looking at me. Look, he sound, the guy was just sounding like me. After he left the phone, you see how he laughed at him. Ordinary, even the developed countries, America, Canada, New York, I mean, um, UK. Then with all the gadgets they have, when there's a homicide case or there's any crime or the crime scene, they will tape everywhere around. They will seal up the whole place. You that don't have all this equipment, you're not saying that you want to wait for six months, seven months. You're still going to find out everything. People are still living in that household. They are flushing things, though. They are, you want to tell me that room, they've not cleaned the room? 
He cleaned the room now. See, don't be surprised that the car that they claim that they drove, eh, that they said that mobile block, uh, punched the window. If you ask them right now, according to them, they say it was a rented vehicle, right? Don't be surprised that if you ask them to provide the vehicle now, the owner of the vehicle is already using that vehicle. Is that supposed Which to is supposed to be an exhibit. Exactly. So welcome to Nigeria. And that is to be what? That's another thing they can use to indict the police. They thought that they are dealing with people who are our... Our, because uh, they have destroyed evidence, so... See, they destroy evidence, they not destroy evidence. That is why a private investigator is needed, all right? That is not going to, going to compromise. We need everything to nail these people. The police are not the, the mess of this case. That's just the way it is. The mess of this case. That press statement from the air to toe, it's not necessary. It's not necessary at all. So far that I did not state it there that Baba Mobile carried the dead body of Mobile. It's not there. It's not written there in the statement. So why did they rule that out? That means that 80 percent or 89 percent of what they said in that whatever is not. It's not true. So, Mobile left previously. That caused a lot of controversial whatever on the internet. They have come and defend since six months. They have not come out to defend themselves. It is. So that's what I have to say. Yeah. You're saying 80, 89%. Me, I'm saying 99% of what's in that police report is not true. So we can't wait for the police report. They need to start from the beginning, give us a true police report, and we can go from there. What we have now is total rubbish. Is that a All the names of the police officers that were involved in the investigation. Uh, even the police that read that press statement, the police that claimed that Baba Mobad uh, met at the station, that did not give Baba Mobad police reports. Those, all those people on duty, they need to summon them. They need to call them up. More their names and every other thing. All their names. The one that was transferred to Abuja need to come and answer some questions. They are the one who messed up this case in the first place. Where did you get your fat right? Did you do proper investigation? You will see that they did not do anything. Because the police that did the briefing to you did not tell you that. They claimed that Mobad, that Prime Bob was the last person that fought with Mobad. And I was telling them that if you claim Prime Bob was the last person that fought with Mobad, that's not true. Somebody else fought with Mobad. That's just the way it is. That's just the way it is. Question the police, call them out, and that's just the way it is. Uh, that's what I have to say. Yeah, thank you. But at this point, which way forward are we going? We've talked about the police and all that stuff, but um, I don't think we are, we are going anywhere with this case because of all the lies that's been told, and the police is not doing anything, and I don't see them doing anything. So, and some people, I see them. All these the police are not doing anything. They're just trying to salvage everything. They don't even know how to salvage it. And even if we try to dig the word out of their mouth, they're going to be lying, lines up a lies, lies up a lies. Because this is disgraceful enough. And the way forward is we need a press conference after the corona inquest. They have to be a press conference. And we have two weeks, less than two weeks left, less than 15 days left. They have to do magic. Um, yes, um, the Laker team, I mean, yeah, the Laker team, blah, 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 blah. Uh, there are some things that I'm aware that they've done, and there are some things that, um, they do not do, like I said, like I, I used to say something, I am open to criticism, all right, if you want, you are, you, you are, of course, you have to be, you have to criticize to improve it, and uh, are we, have they, did they really try? Yes, but... Can they do better? Yes, of course, they should be able to do better. So now, um, there are some things that they've done that they don't want to be on the social media, which I actually, on that, I believe that 100%, in the sense that it's not everything that we have to bring to the social media, but they're supposed to be briefing. Yes, they're supposed to be briefing. And so there are some things that you're supposed to brief to the people that that's going to be like an appetizer to them. I cannot control the legacy. Yes, I can always give them my own 
uh, suggestion. But I guess um, Ensford, they've seen it too. They listen to the people because it's the people that um, that make us to be where we are, they are today. They've also seen it as well. It's the high time they start doing briefing. It's the high time they start um, listening to people and then we just try to do um, work on our mistakes and then, you know, um, savage some of the areas. And I guess according to us, when there's something that they're, work, they're working on, if their thing comes to work perfect before the corona inquest, we're going to let the people know, the people, with, they're going to let them know. Maybe myself or Lady Ryan or um, the legal team themselves, they will let you know. But it's high time they need to start doing briefing, giving you a day to date of what is going on. But the thing is that there are some things that I'm actually aware of that I don't want to take it, bring it to the media because TikTok is not the best place of communicating to people. Because as we are here right now, just know that we have about 20 people here that are not are on our side. They are from the other side. They're coming here to listen to what we have to say. And every little point that you bring out, they're going to use it against us. There was this thing that happened in the past that they're working on how to, um, to what did they say? They use the word. They're trying to close down the property of mobile, like um, restrict or freeze. And then I guess there were a platform that were saying it the more and they were there. And before we know it, some people went to gun, they went to gun freeze it, the management of mobile. So they said there are some things that are supposed to be done on the ground or without the public that you have to do with and they have to be action. And that's just the way it is. Uh, uh. You are right, boss man. Because even then, they do their own meeting on Zoom. On they don't do that. Zoom is meeting. exactly. Zoom is the best place. If you ask any questions, if you have any questions, put me on Zoom. I will. And, they, and they only they only Zoom. invite trusted people, not everybody. Yes. So. See, let me tell you something. I do not know every. We have about one or five people right here. I am not going to come up with, come here and tell you all what I know that I need to tell you because I am not going to be there. Are some people doing screen recording us. I don't know who they are. There are some people here among us here. I don't know. I can't I can't expect the legal team to come up on TikTok to be devoting all our strategies. We've done it in the past and they use it against us and then they step back. All right. There are a lot of politics and all that going on. Yeah, cool. We understand. But the thing is that. I am with them 100% by not coming on social media to divulge a lot of information to you. What other means can we use? Zoom, is, I, I've told them, Zoom is a perfect, perfect way. If you want to engage us, you want us to tell you what is exactly what is going on. Once we know that you, you've not compromised. We know you, we know you, Summer, we know you. Okay, what do you want to know? On Zoom, we know that, okay, these are we, we. We can count how many people are here and we can write that you are really for justice for mobile. We will tell you all what you need to know. Not by we coming on social media on TikTok, where we have about 400 people, 500 people listening to us. We don't know who is who. We don't know if those are from the other side. And then we're not expecting the thing to be giving you everything. So we want to do this. We want to do that. We want to go and do the DNA. Bossman. Oh, no, 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 no. They're not going to do that. Bossman. I want you guys. Social media is also important for disclaimers of some things. See, there's a lot of false narrative going on here. And yeah, so that is why a disclaimer needs to be done too. A see, I was on I was on Cholani's platform on Saturday. If you see the way they were planning to sell out this audio that they sell out today, they were already planning G Center, uh, Semishan Bola, I'm about this. So they have their they have their social media strategy. I know. So we're giving. So we also need. Alarm, so we, we also need a disclaimer for some things, and those things need to be spread out too. Uh, that was like right, that the point that they got um this man um kick round and they, with, with the short time that he worked he did a fantastic work but there was a lot of uh, politics going on the on the on undertone with all these things people said that, that is why if it's for justice why should politics be on this is for justice it's not for self glorification exactly no one is taking the trophy at the end of the day that is where we are we are where we are today and now the space is open and that's just the way it is uh but I guess if you have any questions, anybody who have any questions, set up a Zoom. Let us know once we can vouch for a lot of people that come to my DM. If I don't know you, I say, I say oh, you want, you're asking me questions. But I don't know you. Does this person know you? You say you don't know. You can only talk for yourself. If I do not know you, even I understand calling people's name. Do you know Rashan? Do you know um, um, Papa Riano? Do you know this person? And you do not know, okay, who are those people that are closer to you that you know? You cannot even give names and you expect me to give you some information. I'm not going to. 
give it that to you. But some of us that really want information so bad, you want to know what is going on, come, don't come and ask me quite some questions on the media like this. I am not going to answer you because we are not alone here. We are not. We are not alone. And that's just the truth. We are not alone. There are a lot of things that are lot of recording us. People are recording. You don't want to give your strategies or what you are planning to do or what you're already working on that, you, that has not yet materialized. You want to bring it on social media and then the other team will just quickly, maybe they have more pro, better capacity or better equipment or whatever. They will just go and actualize it, block that side. Then you just cover that. You've been doing this thing and they've already done it. They've already done it. Don't bring everything on social media. That's just the way it is. And then lastly, boss man. You know, there is this Yoruba adage. If, you, if, you, if some of you want, sorry for cutting you so respectfully, man. If you want some of okay. you really eager to talk to the legal team, we can set up a Zoom. And we have to know people that are trusted. And you have to promise that whatever we tell you, you're not going to go on a platform and start devoting everything because we can't give. And people have to be trusted as well. We don't know who is who. <laughs> so people will have access to talk to the legal team. And the next thing, they go to the platform and start devoting all these things. We have to be very careful as well with all the information that we also bring up. You guys are aware of uh, a lady, a woman that was that decided to pay to attend with Baba Mubad as a friend. And while he was with Baba Mubad, he was recording every conversation of Baba Mubad. And the next thing, he went back to the other camp and started using the audio to black him Baba Mubad. Look at that. I hope you guys no, are planning it since Saturday now. She she it was an open plan. Like they were really they were really ready to bring that this week. They really want to use social media this week. In fact, they were talking about online day. The online day is already taking up the Twitter space. They need because to go to we, Twitter. We need, we, need, we, need, we need to do more of I'm part I'm impressed with the Twitter team. I will tell you they were winning, but when we've gone there, our presence is already there, but they are still winning. We need to bombard that Twitter part. Because and they need to sue that for learning because she recorded without Baba's. She she used that man's vulnerability. Uh, uh, and now she's playing out that audio as if the audio is just a new audio. And this is a, is, is an audio that has been in existence before now. See, this game is just a, it's a game of chase. You just have to, every one of us have to play along with it. We, they come with their own template. We don't know what they're planning. They're trying to make Umi. If I tell you that... Yesterday, we, now, when they needed if I, if I, to plan something if, if more serious, you, some people they are going on Zoom. Some people say that Umi is not in Nigeria right now. If I tell you that Umi is in Nigeria, as, as we speak, and Umi is not in Lagos, it's likely Umi is in Ogun State. Mm -hmm. Likely Umi is in Ogun State, not in Lagos State, for security reasons. So that's just the way it is. So... They're planning. They are doing all the best to make sure that they sell their own narrative and all stuff like that. And it is what it is. So we also... And all those, all those boys, those PAs that, that are recording Baba that are doing those rubbish, the backlash, the backstory of those videos are not are not favorable. They should stop all those content. I don't know if those are... The PA need to be stopped because I think it's item Baba needs to... Okay. Baba doesn't need a PA. He only needs a legal advisor. Today I was so angry. Some people were even bashing me that I'm anti-justice. Yeah, we just need to put Baba to all that. You don't need to drag Baba on that. There are some things that he did recently that I don't, that is not really necessary. It's not really necessary for him to do all that. Uh, I was told, uh, I saw, when I saw the video, I saw like a store and all that, but it is, but we just have to, you know, we have to, you need to watch those where, if you want to go on the internet or on TikTok, you need to know those. It's not supposed not to be seen, you need to pipe low a little bit. You need to pipe low a little bit. Yeah, you need to pipe low a little bit. I don't know. You know, Baba is from Ekiti. You know, he wanted to do his own stuff as well. You know. So, like I said, whatever I said today, I am not representing. I am talking on my own. I'm not talking in the on um, for the legal thing. I'm only telling you what is naturally necessary for us to do. And um, about the press conference, I guess it's long term, long overdue. We need to do that, and that's just the way it is. Moving forward. Uh, we have about the 15 days. We want to see what we can arrive, what we can do um, before the 15th of um, the court um, press uh, corona inquest. Uh, before the 15th of um, the court um, corona inquest. So that's just the way it is. So, um, yeah, the bigger team, they are, doing their, they are doing what they can do. But can they do better? Yes. Criticism is allowed. 
I support criticism. You have to. And it just depends on the way you put it. Your criticism shouldn't be about dragging and all stuff like that. But I'm letting you know. I will give you an expo. There are some member. There's a member of the legal team that always come on every platform to listen to what you all say. I'm telling you that fact right now. A member of the legal team, as in the legal team, that always come on every platform to listen to what you guys say, and they have they listen to us too. And that's just the truth. They will not just come to you and come on the box and talk to you guys. They listen to you. They have a platform. They have their own account. They listen to what people say. They know who Papariano is. They know who some of the hosts. Uh, all right, they know. So they listen. Criticism is allowed, but we have to just be constructive. That's what I have to say. Yeah, for the Baba, Baba going to all those platforms, I wasn't really happy how they were talking to him. And they only had like 30 something people on the platform. Like he doesn't even need to go to all those places where they don't respect him. It was a mistake. He did not know where he was. That's why I heard that it was a mistake. It was a mistake. Oh, good, yeah. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Um, how are you? Fine, Lady Aris. How are you, darling? I'm good. And you? I'm blessed. I'm, I'm in bed. Oh. But... <laughs> I thought, how are you doing? Uh, somebody said Wumi changed. I'm fine, thank you. I'm fine, thanks. Yeah, they said Wumi changed her name. When did Wumi change her name to the Ura Ola or something? That, what is his name? Uh, the PS uh, last name. Is that the one? I don't know. Is that because that Yeah. No, 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 no. No, Ura Ola. I mean the last name of uh, the PA. Is it the Sheyi's last name? Is that what? Awonuga. 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 Is that the one? Well, basically, so I've always I've, I've found two different websites online stating that her last name is actually Awonuga, not Adibanjo. Um, that's basically why I put that there. But I, I'm just hearing what you're saying about the first name being what? Sorry again? No, 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 no. I think it's Ash. Um, I said did she change her name to Sheyi's last name, which is Awonuga. That's I, why. I, 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 the thing is, I'm not sure if she's just planning to change it or this is the original name before actual justice for mobile started. Because this has been online for a long time. Before September. Because I know last year she was, uh, according to Papa Papa, she was at the bank job. And I think her passport reads at the bank job. I think so. Okay, okay. I think. Yeah, I'm just I'm saying I'm just confused with the Awonuga I'm finding online. That's why I just don't want us to leave it out. So if we're maybe putting all those uh, letters out there, emails out there, we should add this name just in case she's trying to do something, you know, with that. Yeah, good idea, but it's going to be very cumbersome because if you know her response from the her legal teams, they refer to her as um, Adebanjo or Aloba. I have never seen anywhere where any of the legal representatives refer to her as Abinuga. So, but we will be at a lot and make sure that is, uh, you know, we, will, like, we can't take anything past her, you know? Definitely. Definitely. Mm. So, <laughs> nice to um, have you up. Just... What is that one? I said, nice to have you up. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. Thank you very much. I mean, you grace my platform too. I don't even know you've been there. I don't know. I don't know. But um, so far, so good. Uh, I think talk is cheap. Action is louder. And like I keep saying, there is no nothing that's supposed to not come out to the open. There's absolutely nothing. So we should not just blow talk 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 no actions currently there's really nothing much going on um papa legal teams i spoke with the barrister very wonderful man so there's no secret anywhere um currently they have submitted a letter to the magistrate courts to enable them to paste the dna uh, writ of summit. It is not a court order yet. A writ of summit is what they're trying to give to me. And she is running, I mean, she cannot evade uh, the law. But we 
the the legal teams of Baba just needs to do the right thing. So, and which they have taken some steps. They have submitted a motion to the magistrate courts in order to help so they can paste the writ of summit. Writ of summit is uh, like a invitation letter to a wedding. So the writ of summit is not an order to go and do the DNA. It's just come to the court, let's discuss. Uh, I want a DNA, you don't want a DNA. We go in front of a judge and we will go and talk about it. Okay, so now that it's been a while, I think almost two, three weeks now, and they've taken it back to court so they can paste that bridge of summit. They can paste it. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Yes, I spoke to Mr. The barrister uh, Taiwo Odumosu. Yes, I spoke to him with Geresi and a few others. We were in a meeting together. Um. Um, so they have gone to the court to get the application, uh, get the order to uh, post it on the last known address. And probably they will do two, is it two or three uh, legal, they will do two or three um, well-recognized newspaper. They will publish it in the well-recognized newspaper. And then, of course, other social media handles. Since we all know that um, she, since we all know that she is on TikTok and she wants to fire her for us. So, I actually, personally, I think I have sent a message to even give me a copy of the writ of summit so that we can start posting it. Anything we can do, but I have not gotten a response yet. When I get response, then I will. Um, I will start posting it. And I don't think there's any law against that. But I have not gotten a response here. So, and also, um, we they've also sent out, um, elect, um, written a motion so they can uh, employ the service of a PI. PI as in private investigator. And I think Soma is aware of that, I believe. And then that's will because, you know, you need the court order for that because there are vital informations the PI will be uh, requesting and doing and then uh, they need the a judge to attest to it and they're going to be going into the police station like for example nobody can request for somebody's call logs unless it's a court order so that's why that is that way um, what, else, what else am I aware of and of course there are a few other petitions that have been discussed, like um, Prime Boy did this, so he also petitioning the police officer. Right now, I personally want to follow up on that petition because um, I want that particular IP O Mohammed to be uh, set aside. I want him out of this case for now, uh, pending his investigation and further official disciplinary actions for his involvement um, in trying to coerce um, Prime Boy to admit to a crime he did not. Something that. But the fact is this. Upon the fact that, yeah, this guy has put his hand in some dirty things. Let us come to reality. Let us come to reality. We mean, you know, we know in one way or the other, you try to protect your husband. Yes. Because during the NDLA of a thing, there is eventually, they said, there is not government official that came into that place, and you are standing in the front of gun that they should shoot you. I understand. You try as much as possible to protect your husband because this is one of your assets. Good. Fine. Why can't you come out to tell us what happened? What happened that led to the death of Mubad? It is by mistake. It is by challenge. Come out and come and tell us in a very simple language that all the world will you know, we'll be able to reason with you, okay, okay, maybe uh, this or that. It is as very simple. Uh, you know, 
I try as much as possible to make it like, let me even light off my head. Let me even, you know, all this burden of thing. Let me remove it from my head. And let me see how simple that things can be. Let me see if I want to be on the side of me to be able to, okay, you have tried to protect this person. You know the do and don't of this person. And you know what this person like. He is not feeling fine. He don't want to go to hospital. We all agree with you. Yes, we all agree with you. We are all different, right? But at the same time, do you think that with the condition as which this guy was as at that time, you don't think that he need medical attention more than just calling a nurse to come and treat our home? Come and treat him at home. The only answer you give us is, oh, he didn't like to go to hospital. Like, for real. Like, does it play out well? Why are you coming to lie to the whole world that this guy died on Tuesday? What happened on, on Monday morning? On the fact that we, we even get to know that there are a lot of things that, that play out that you didn't even tell us about when you are coming home. We only hear about what happened with the prime boy when they are the show. What happened when you leave? When prime boy was not there, what happened between that time till Monday morning? In fact, till, till, till Tuesday morning that you claim that this guy has you. Simple, simple thing. Simple thing. Leave it simple. Make it simple. Let us digest it simple. Let everybody be able to analyze it in a very simple way. Why, why are you hiding under one finger? With the book that we are able to understand or find out that, okay, there is something that happened on the bridge and that's what the past corona inquiry was all about. We understand that there is a CCTV, there is a DVR in the house. We understand the fact that a lot of lies, a lot of things that you lied about by just a simple analysis, which when we push it to you, you like, mm, uh, you can't even talk in a very simple way that we understand. It gets to a level whereby, you know, someone is coming to say, yeah, I am ready to talk about this. And you're like, we shouldn't listen to that person. Who else are you even standing for? What type of justice do you even want? Or maybe you made a mistake in the first video that you did. You make second, you make second one, you still did another mistake. Or we are the one that is misinterpreting, uh, misinterpreting you. Come and debunk a lot of things that is on ground. It's a very simple thing. It's a very simple thing. And you can you think that you can just continue like that for how long? How can you run? How far can you run? Press my keys, oh. Let me leave it. Papa Riano, please, oh. <laughs> it's really sad. It's troublesome. Yeah. But we keep speaking out. We keep saying it for them to know that we want the justice to come out and they must give that justice to the nigerian people and they must give it to people all over the world we want that justice we want the evil to stop the thing that they have been doing now it's out everybody have seen it and we want it to stop we want that to stop the killing Killing innocent people. Can you imagine? Look at Mubad. Very talented boy. Very talented guy. You look that guy. You look that particular man like that. Send him. Out of this world. Take him out of this world. For no reason. Just because of your greediness. Hey, this life. Let us be careful, oh, people that 
people that surround you should always be watching your back. You think they love you. They are the enemy of your progress. This is what happened to Mubad. She, he loved all these people. Even the wife controlled everything. To the time, he noticed that, oh, this kind of wife, I've involved myself with.